Steve Stone, broadcaster for your Chicago White Sox. The, maybe the best color analyst ever. Uh, he's up there. We did our we did our whole rankings uh, of his partnerships with uh, broadcasters throughout his 40-year career, but when he had his anniversary a few weeks ago. But he is uh, multi-talented beyond being a Cy Young Award-winning pitcher, uh, being one of the best broadcasters I've ever heard. He is also a screenwriter and film producer, apparently, as he is has revealed that he has been working on and is about to release his own feature film. <laughs> He's been very mysterious about this, uh, this announcement. Uh, I heard him mention this on the radio kind of in passing, and then it's subsequently been on uh, his Twitter feed, he mentioned. He is indeed making a feature film uh, based in fact, but it's about baseball in the future. Yes. So, I mean, is I, I think the future, the first thing I think of is, you know, sci-fi movie of some sort. <laughs> I don't know. But so nobody really knows what it is. He is very confident that is a, it, it will be well received. It's a fantastic film. Uh, I don't know if it's done or when it's being released. It, the, the details are sketchy, but I thought, uh, I thought it'd be fun to try to, figure out what he's what he's making the movie about or what the title of this movie could possibly be the first thing that came to my mind just the obvious steve stone the motion picture <laughs> but it's... referencing star trek the his sci-fi epic well you um, know and also too when i when you first uh tweeted that over to me i'm like oh they're making a documentary film or like a biopic on steve stone but and, and then... people have people have supposed that and he he's responded to those those uh inquiries and he says no not nearly creative enough yeah so it's been his response to a biopic no not doing that he's he's a very creative uh idea for this film yeah i mean I... well the rest of my ideas are, are terrible, but the, the and I already brought one up to you, but I thought maybe he would reprise the role of the infamous Brian Bosworth in Stone Cold. I think that that would be a perfect uh, that that movie definitely needs to be remade. Uh, Mid eighties, Brian Bosworth. If you kids don't know, is a a star linebacker, I believe, for Oklahoma uh, that eventually played for the Seattle Seahawks. That was. Uh, his basically his career ended when uh, Bo Jackson just ran him over and made him look like a rag doll. He sure uh, did on, on Monday Night Football, I believe. Uh, Brian I just, Bosworth was also a an action hero. He was much more than just a football player. He was in in films such as Stone Cold, which I had completely forgotten about until I started looking up films that had the word Stone in it for this bit. Um, that was it was a tremendous find. Uh, basically, Brian Bosworth is more of a haircut than than an athlete or an actor. He had the famous mullets with like weird shit shaved in the side of his head. Uh, I thought that'd be fun. The only other idea I could come up with would be uh, Steve Stone is uh, release re-releasing romancing the stone of uh, Ooh, romance. Novel, yes, a romance. Type. Romance movie, uh, action slash romance movie. Well, it could be the romantic side of baseball. Perhaps <laughs> that's the. There the is future. a romance to baseball that he, that is, he a, is well aware of. So yeah, maybe. Uh, yeah, I I had. What did I reply back to you? Stone Cold something, and then and then you said Stone Cold this, Facts. Yeah, that, Stone Cold what, Facts. Yeah. That's what made me think of Stone the Cold. cold. I mean, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I I don't know. Have you even seen what I'm talking about or is this all news to you or did you, I think the only two places I've seen it were, or I've heard about it is one was just part of a radio interview on the score. I forget who he is with. And then this, he's, he has tweeted about it, but I haven't seen any other news essentially. Yeah. I haven't, I, I didn't hear about it until you sent that to me. Mm. I have heard nothing. I didn't hear. I haven't heard him bring it up on the broadcast at all. So, well, I'll be sure to keep keep abreast of the situation. I will report back on next week's episode if any news has has leaked about this feature film. And uh, I, I'm I'm dying to know more about this for sure. So, I mean, I'm I'm interested to see what his. I mean, I just feel it's his him and whoever's helping them with the film, their take on what baseball is going to look like 
in a go forward situation. Yeah, in twenty five, twenty two. Is it like years a, from now? Is it like baseball runner, like Blade Runner or something? <laughs> yeah, maybe a bunch I of mean, replicants playing, yeah, playing baseball. Yeah. You have to find out which ones are real and which ones are more human than human. Who knows? Yeah, and then like you have to you have to dispose of them. <laughs> All right, we're getting too deep into the weeds now. Alex, and- so. Media.